Okay, hi. We are gonna make bromelades today, which is this flower right here. It's a tropical flower. Um, and first we have to make sure that you have all the supplies that you need. We pre-cut some petals. So you need four small petals and 10 of the larger petals. And as you can see, they're pretty close in size. So if you have all larger, you know, it's okay. Um, but they should be small and, and medium or large. Then you need one green skewer and you're either going to be using a glue gun, which is very hot, like hot glue is coming out of this and it doesn't feel great if it gets on your skin. So you want to avoid touching this hot part here, um, and avoid getting the glue on your fingers. If you're not using a glue gun on your petals, then you're gonna be using these glue dots, which are probably kind of hard to see, but there's sticky pieces of round glue right on this, um, and you peel them off. So we'll talk about that later. All right, once you have all your supplies laid out, you're gonna to wanna to take your petals and start to fold it in half. Like that and it's, it's not going to be a perfect fold but try to get it as close to exactly halfway as you can and you're going to do that with all um, 14 of your petals all right so when you start you want the pointy end down and you're going to start to attach your petals up at the flat end and you take your first petal and when you put glue on it if you're using a glue gun, it goes about here and here, two tiny dots. With glue guns, less is definitely more. And you're gonna put it at the top of the stick and then right in the crease, and then squeeze the two ends together and kind of hold it there for a minute so that the glue gets stuck. Like that. So your first one looks like this. All right, if you're using the glue dots like this, you can see the shiny round glue dot. You can take your finger and try to pull it off. If that doesn't work, kind of bend the paper back a little bit and peel it off. You wanna keep it as flat as possible. You don't want it to ball up. So once you have it like this, you're gonna hit that same spot on the petal, right about there. Try to get it off your finger. We'll grab another one. I'm kind of bending this back and peeling it off there so it's on my finger like that. And I put this one on the other side. And kind of smush it down. And then you go in to put your next petal. And if you're using a glue gun, you would just put two glue dots there. And don't squeeze it until it's in the right spot that you want it to be, which is, oh, one important thing is, see this crease? This is where the, where the petals connect. That's the side you wanna to go to next. So I gotta switch sides. So I'm gonna come over here and I kinda of hold it out so that it looks like this and squeeze so that the glue gets stuck together. So notice I still put the the stem this into the crease, but I have this with a little bit of area right here. And if you look at the finished one, you kind of go back and forth with a little bit of area in between them so you can see the individual flower petals as you go. So if I show you one more, this one we'll do with a glue gun. We're gonna put a dot kind of here and here. And then I gotta get it lined up right and put it against the stem high enough up so it covers up that other crease and squeeze it. So the top of my flower looks like that. Once you squeeze it, you can't really rip it off easily. So you wanna make sure you line it up and it's in the right area before you press together because it's, it's really hard to redo. Okay, so you can see we have the petal at the top and then we're rotating back and forth. And because I, my last one, the crease, the opening is on this side, the next one, you can see where I put my glue dots, 
needs to go on this side. One other thing I forgot to mention is that glue guns sometimes drip. So we have plates for you to keep the glue gun on if you have a glue gun. Um, another thing is as you go, sometimes you get these like wispy gluey strands. Just, it's just hardened glue. So as you go, kind of pick them, pick them off and put them in a little pile um, so that it doesn't look all messy on your flower. All right, we're gonna get started. All right, we'll pull the wispies. These are the little wispy things I was talking about that somebody gets stuck on your hand. And there is the bromelade. <laughs> 